Raider caverns, once discovered, attract all manner of scavengers. We should be careful. Well, here we are on part three. And all I'm going to say is boss fight, because that is what this pretty much is, is one, you want to say huge boss fight, and let me tell you, I am not equipped properly for this. The loadout that I used, for the most part, seemed to work, but it did not work here. I pretty much spent this entire part right here getting my ass handed to me over and over and over they are very, very good at trapping you. Um, <laughs> the Monarch seems to have this incredibly impossible range with this melee. And with just knocking me around at will. You're like, come on, man, make him actually hit me so I can, like, you know, have a fair chance. So, I mean, you're going to see it. And I made it all the way through this, you know. The, the whole point of this was to be my first playthrough. And I wanted to post the first playthroughs up. And I wanted to not have to use Hunter Requisitions. You're going to see frustration set in here. You're going to see it happen. Just once. <laughs> Just once. So, it, it, it could definitely be worse. But I, I think I was really, you know, kind of wishing for Bio right here. Bio, I think, would have helped me a lot better. Um, uh, bio Resistant Shield would have helped me better. Uh, because they were just ripping me to shreds with the bio, the bugs, especially. And you, know, you saw some of the other parts, the previous parts, and these crystals are always in the way. That's that's always fun too. But then they're just constantly shooting bio, and the range on the bio attacks doesn't even have to be near you, and it just rips you to shreds. So, I mean, yeah, if you can't tell, I, I got trapped in the room before. I'm doing everything I can to really not back into the starting room. Because I don't want to get trapped in there again. Because that really, really sucked. Um, I think one of my mistakes was staying in this room. I probably should have gone into the next room. But uh, it's one of those things. You, you kind of live and you learn. And look at that. I was jumping and was already down. Crap. And it's one of those things. You, you, know, you know you're in a bad spot. I'm trapped. And see, as soon as I jump up, blammo. They just, they were holding me here, and it was not making me happy. <laughs> I'm not really sure else, how else to say it right there, but, uh, yeah, it's lots of rolling on the hell bug hunt, and it's, it's, it's really frustrating if your loadout is wrong. Honestly, look at this. I was like, really? How is this even possible? It's one of those things I just didn't quite catch how I could be down there, but... Yeah, that's where I used it. I was I was pissed and I was see look at that. God here's further, further. I was I was not happy at this point. I really should have ran in here to the boat. I have no idea why I was determined not to. It's, it's kind of a live and learn type of situation. And uh, I was just determined I was not gonna go down into there for some odd reason. There may be a reason that I just don't remember off the top of my head, but I just wasn't going in there. I just kept blowing up the crystals. I don't really understand what the crystals were for, really. But a bio gun and some form of explosive, I would say, would be extremely, extremely handy. Well, why didn't you do something? Well, <laughs> pretty darn obvious they weren't giving me squat for time to uh, consider changing anything. And uh, this was my biggest break right here. Look how awesome this guy is. Thank you for standing here. Yes. Yes. Please continue to soak up the damage, sir. That is super awesomely wonderful of you. And it's like trapped right there. I got it trapped somehow. And so, yeah, I was trying to take as, as much as much advantage of the situation as I could. And uh, that last little sliver of health he had in the end, though, he is just not going to want to try to lose that. So, yeah, this is a lack of ammo, too. Look at this. Just shooting those crystals out. I wonder if that really hurts you a lot when they come out. I don't know what they're for. I'm shooting them. Going, you know, what exactly is this crystal is about? And one, whatever. We're just going to take them out. <laughs> so, because I didn't see the crystals, like, causing him any damage or nothing. So, I, I don't, you know, I don't know if there's really much of a point in me shooting him at this point since I... Not that I had a lot of time to pay attention, but I don't really know what the crystal, the crystals were about, what they were actually supposed to do. Unless, I mean, I know they were spawning hell bugs, but I mean, 
spawning the little ones wasn't too bad. I mean, I was happy with this. Look at this. Yay, something purple. It's always nice to get a purple on the first round because I think it was the first time I'd seen a purple on the first round. It's always been blue. I, I've gotten a purple on a second round before, and of course on the third round I've seen a purple. But I was I was pleased with that a purple on a uh, round one. Yes, I'll t I'll take that every single day of the week because. You're already plowing through these rounds as it is, or I'll, I'll say you're plowing through the rounds. You're attempting to plow through rounds, but I've never really gone past three. Like I said, I, I, I critted out on three once, and that was as far as I got. I was like, okay, yeah. That's, you turn it off, you go on about your business. But uh, the sniper, sniper where it is handy, right? The second, uh, not my suggestion. Once you, once before you open the door, you're going to have to have something else. Uh, I think an explosive really, really would have been the better choice in this situation uh but yeah this seems like running in here would actually have been better a more ideal situation than running around in one tiny little room you just there's so much health it takes so much longer uh, ha habit is hard to break and habit tells me uh one normal clip and one overcharged clip or less than an over overcharged clip and I can take out a monarch, so yeah, that's just not going to be possible in these. So probably just it's, it's going to be a strategy thing. What friend is going to use what nano, and who's going to use what weapons? And things will probably be better. And yes, if you're wondering in the end, if you don't have it mentioned it by the time you got to this, yes, yeah, that arena looks similar to the last one, if not identical, didn't it? So looks like a little copy and paste going on. But anyways, that's the final part of this one, and I will catch you guys. Later.